Most of you watching this video probably already are aware of the major problem we Toyota owners have with our lower control arm cam bolts freezing up. If you're not aware of this problem, you certainly will next time you go to get a front end alignment. You'll likely be told that they have to cut your old arms off and put new ones on in order to get a proper alignment. Many, including us, thought that we were going to prevent this from ever happening by, when the vehicle was new, taking those cam bolts out and putting on a thick coat of anti-seize. In this video, I'm going to explain to you why this step won't make a damn bit of difference and debunk the myth once and for all. In order to make alignment adjustments, this goofy looking offset washer has to be able to rotate between these tabs that are welded to the frame. The front and the rear cam bolt assemblies are different. In the rear, that long bolt going through actually turns those cam washers making the adjustments. So putting never sees on the rear bolts is definitely beneficial. In the front, however, that long bolt going through does not turn those cam washers. It just holds the lower control arm to the frame. The alignment adjustment is actually made by putting a wrench on here. This nut or wrench surface is actually part of a separate steel sleeve that goes through the steel sleeve in the bushing. That steel alignment sleeve that this is attached to is actually what freezes up inside that bushing sleeve, not the bolt going through. Not in the front anyways. In the back, sure, but not in the front. So putting anti-seize on that forward lower control arm bolt will not prevent the alignment cams from freezing up. It'll help you get the bolt out, so there's no harm in doing it. So about the only thing to prevent that alignment sleeve from freezing up in there is when the vehicle is brand new, take that lower control arm completely off, somehow pull that sleeve out and coating it with anti-seize. And as further prevention, turn those cam adjustments at least once a year to keep them from freezing up. For us, we're fixing that problem once and for all by installing aftermarket lower control arms and these aftermarket cam bolts and adjustment washers. We're also producing a video on that, and when it's done, you'll see a link right there. And if you want to see more, I mean many, many more videos on modifying and preventative maintenance on Toyotas, please consider subscribing to our channel and hit that bell notification.